In this tutorial, we will teach you how to create macros in MS Word 2010. Go to the View tab and select the Record Macro option from the Macros drop-down menu. Once done, a dialog box will appear on your screen where you can name the macro and then assign the macro to either a button or keyboard. In the video, we chose to assign it to a button. So, click on the button with a hammer shape and assign the macro to a button. Once done, the Customize Quick Access Toolbar window will open up. In this window, select the macro from the left pane and then press the Add button to shift it to the right pane and include it in the Quick Access Toolbar list. You may find the name of the macro too big, so you can always modify its name. Select the macro first and then click on the Modify button at the bottom of the window. Once done, a new window opens up where you can change the display name of the macro and choose a symbol for the macro. Once you have made the modifications, the macro will appear in the Quick Access Toolbar list. Now, you will notice that your cursor is attached with a tape type symbol. Anything that you will do or write now will be recorded. So, start typing text at the end of the document. You can also adjust alignment by clicking on any style. Once you are done with the settings, click on the Save button in order to save the changes. Go back to the Macros drop-down menu and select the Stop Recording option.